I'm live, guys. That's cool. It's cool to be live. It's cool to be alive, I guess. Just out mowing, mowing a commercial property. And I was going to share something with you guys that uh, I didn't share before because it's really not that big of a deal. It's not like a giant thing like, oh, my stuff was stolen or anything. It's just stuff that happens. So I'm here at a commercial property that I mow, and I always park my truck over here where this vehicle is, but right now there's someone here. I always like to back it up here. And two weeks ago, I was mowing this property, and someone came by while I was mowing. There's another back section way back there in the corner. Someone drove by. They stole my five-gallon sure can, and they stole... Let me switch this. So they stole a five-gallon sure can, and they stole a uh, safety cone from me. No big deal. Not worried about it. That's easy stuff I can get back. That's, that's not a big deal at all. But I pull up here today... And one of the people from inside said, hey, a couple weeks ago when you were here, did you leave this? I'm like, leave what? So she comes out with a still BG86 handheld blower, okay? Uh, now this property right here where I'm at, as you can see, all this, this ginormous hill up here, when it rains hard, everything just flushes and swarms down here. There's a lot of times where I gotta move tons and tons of stuff. And as you can see here and back over there, a lot of people always dump stuff. So, okay, I lost those two things. No big deal, somebody came by, took some stuff from me. But is karma real? Because I show up today and they've had this BG86, which at first I was assuming, okay, the people that came and stole my stuff actually dropped this so I'm in the wind, but I don't think that's what happened at all. I literally think this thing washed up here because they were like, hey, if you can get it to work, it's yours. I'm like, sure, no problem. I've been you know, doing this long enough to where I'm sure I can get something like this to work. But this thing looks like it has just, it's been through a complete war. The gas tank was filled up with like little rocks, mud, and sand. Like it literally, it looks like it washed up somewhere and somebody chucked it or it fell off a truck a long time ago or something. Uh, the exhaust manifold's all kind of rusted up and stuff like that. So I pour a little bit of gas in it and uh, shake it all around, dump the gas back out of it to see what would happen. I pretty much got it all out of there, but... Uh, Great time to do a live stream. Just got out of class. There you go, dude. But yeah, dude. So I was finicking this with this for a little bit. Like I said, it looks like it's been through a war. All I did, guys, is dump the stuff that was in it, swish some gas around, get all the dirt and rocks and sand and stuff that was in the gas tank out. Somebody already took the spark arrestor out at one point. But uh, yeah, turn it on choke. Turn the choke off. Maybe. Now it's being finicky. Looks like it's working to me. And the cool thing about this is I've actually been contemplating buying a new handheld blower just to not have to throw the backpack on all the time. I don't know how long this thing's gonna last because I don't know, it's, it's, got a, it's got a really rough idle. I have to tinker it when I'm like, home. But it's just going back to those things on Karma. So a couple weeks ago, I'm here. Somebody comes by while I'm mowing back there and steals my safety cone and steals a five gallon gas tank, king. five gallon sure can from me. Two weeks go by, I come here, and a still random BG86 that's just been beaten to hell washes up, and it works fine. So, it's like, is karma real? That's the, that's the thing, guys. Is karma real? So, if you go around doing what you're supposed to be doing nice, something bad happens to you, do you usually get something back out of it? If you're a bad person, does bad things always happen to you type of a deal? So, I don't know. That's cool. Spent a little bit of money, got a cone back, got a sure can back, and then randomly, they come out and say this handheld blower washed up and it's yours if it works so that's pretty awesome guys but i gotta get back to work i just wanted to share that little story with you you know no matter what stuff happens guys stuff's gonna get stolen from you stuff's gonna break just keep your head up you never know what kind of randomness is coming your way so just wanted to share that quick story with you guys i hope everybody's having a great day like comment subscribe guys i gotta get back to mowing man i got some clouds coming in it might rain tomorrow who knows random things to take exactly dude that's actually a second cone I've stolen, or not I've stolen, that's been stolen from me. 
but it's just cones. They're not a big deal. Same thing with the gas cans. They're, they're not a big deal. It's not that much money. People want to do that. But if it is so that I didn't notice that was there and whoever stole my uh, sure can and my uh, safety cone from me accidentally dropped this uh, handheld blower, I'm definitely winning in that situation. So you never know what exactly happened. I don't think that's what happened because this literally looks like it's been, you know, rolling down a river and shit. This is BG86, not in the greatest condition. But yeah, guys, like, comment, subscribe, man. We'll see you guys in the next one. I got to get back to work. Have a great day, guys.